Welcome to County Office, your complete guide to local government services and public records. Let's start learning. How does a coroner determine cause of death? Ever wondered how a coroner, the Sherlock Holmes of the medical world, uncovers the mystery behind someone's demise? Let's dive in. A coroner starts by conducting an external examination, looking for any visible signs of trauma or disease. It's like playing the world's most serious game of I spy, but with a medical degree. Next, the coroner may order an autopsy, a detailed internal examination. This isn't for the faint of heart, folks. It involves dissecting the body to examine the organs for signs of disease or injury. Think of it as a biology class, but with higher stakes. Sometimes the cause of death isn't immediately apparent, even after an autopsy. In such cases, the coroner may order further tests, such as toxicology screens. It's a bit like a detective waiting for lab results in a thrilling crime drama, only it's real life and the stakes are higher. Finally, the coroner completes a death certificate, including the cause and manner of death. It's like the final chapter of a mystery novel, revealing all the secrets. Remember, while this may seem like a grim task, coroners play a crucial role in public health and justice. And that, dear friends, is how a coroner determines the cause of death. Take a look at the links in the description below to learn more. If you have any questions or want to share your thoughts, leave a comment. We're here to help. Thanks for watching our video. Be sure to like, subscribe, and leave a comment below. We'll see you in our next video.